And that breaking news from Independence, where a police officer shot and killed a man tonight. Good evening, I am Bria Berry. Police say this all started as a shots fired call near Truman and Lee Summit Roads. KNBC 9's Peyton Hadley is live at that scene with what we're learning so far about this investigation. Peyton. And Bria, this seems to be a pretty quiet neighborhood. You can see crime scene tape is still up out here and a few officers are still on scene, but it is pretty dark out here as well. Lights are off and there are not a lot of street lights on this street, but what we could see was this shattered doorway at the house. The crime scene sort of centers around. Now we know officers came here on a shots fired call. Those calls came from people in the area saying a man was outside of a house and possible shots had been fired. When officers got here, they say there was a man in the entryway to the front door. The officers gave him commands. We don't know what those commands were, but it ended with the officers shooting and killing him. He was declared dead on the scene. They say they did discover a handgun in the area that he had been, but it's not clear if he had been holding it when he was shot. They say he was wearing a fanny pack with multiple rounds of ammunition in it. Now, detectives are still in the beginning stages of figuring out what all led up to this, but they say this is a hard spot for officers to be in. You know, that's law enforcement. You know, sometimes we encounter people that are armed with guns and sometimes we, you know, have to encounter um, folks that are wanting to do harm to us and do harm to the public. And so, um, you know, while it's frustrating, again, that's just part of, you know, what we're trained to do. And back here at the scene, we don't know if anyone else was inside of that house or if that man lived in the neighborhood. We do know that detectives from many different agencies will be investigating here and those officers involved in the shooting. Two of them are on administrative leave tonight. Live in Independence, Peyton Headley, KNBC 9 News. All right, Peyton, thank you. And if you saw anything or know anything about what happened, you can reach out to Crime Stoppers at number 816-474-TIPS. We'll be following this investigation closely as it develops. Get updates as they come in with our KNBC 9 News app. We'll send your alerts right to your phone as we learn more.